Hi ladies, I'm back with part three of the baby's dress for Christmas. And I think I have even more babies than I thought I did. So it may be, after this, it may be two more videos. So it's going to be um, at least five videos. Uh, maybe, hopefully not more than that. Anyway, let's get started. These two little girls are sitting in the bouncer. And over here is Grumpy Grace. And she is a Grinch hybrid. Let me turn a little face around so you can see a little bit better. She has pigtails, curly pigtails as you can see and they are green and pink tinged there. Not real dark colored but she's thinking about, I think she's thinking about Santa or Christmas. She's looking, she's looking up at something and she's got beautiful green eyes. Like I said she is a hybrid, a um, human and Grinch hybrid. She's wearing her red sleeper with a reindeer on the front and reindeer on the feet. Sitting beside her is um, Miss Wis Wisching. And she's made after my um, sister-in-law who passed away. And it had actually um, I had her made after her before um, she passed. But anyway, she's gorgeous. Her hair is a little messy. I meant to brush it, but... It's okay. She's got beautiful hair. She was made by Forever You Reborn and also Juju B was made by the same artist. She's a retired Barrager sculpt and she is beautiful. You can see her. She has rooted lashes and rooted eyebrows and rooted hair. And she's gorgeous. And she's tiny little thing. She wears a preemie and newborn both. See a little hand. Oh, she is wearing a white. Oh, is that a little bit too loud? I'm going to turn it down in a minute. She's wearing a white sleeper with pastel reindeers and snowflakes on it. You can see that. And she has little reindeer, pink reindeers on the feet. And if you could just excuse me for a moment, I am going to turn this down because it is a little bit loud. There. Okay, that's better, I think. Here, they in here um, is Haven. She was my womb baby that I opened out of her womb. And she is a Sydney sculpt, and she's a crying baby. She was made by Katie's Precious Angels Reborn Nursery. And she's with my good dolly friends, and she is wearing a, this is a vintage outfit, a striped, I much reminds me of candy canes, a striped sleeper, and the sleeves are a little fancy-like. And she has a little collar that's fancy, too, and I put her with a little Santa hat, because she's a baldy with a bow. So there's Haven and she's just crying away. She's crying. So there's Miss Haven. Over here is one of my Saskias. Like I said, I have four Saskias. And this outfit is a little bit too snug for him for my taste, but it's a zero to three month or three month. He actually wears three to six months better. But anyway, that's what I had. So he's wearing his striped um, green and gray outfit with Santa face on the chest there and I put this hat with it. it doesn't actually go but it's gonna go today it's another green and white striped hat and he has beautiful green eyes he was made by an artist um, that doesn't no longer makes babies off of eBay an unknown artist and he's just beautifully has that beautiful red skin tone and um, I named him Cedric after my grandfather because he favors my grandfather and the man in my family with the with the um, light hair and light eyes. He's got he's a ginger. You can see he's got nice rooted hair in there. All right, there's that baby boy. He's handsome. She really did paint him nicely. He's really pretty. I like his eyebrows. So he's there. And this guy, you always see him, and he's in his native american regalia so this is a special day he's in um another striped outfit with a stain on the front but see this one has the red stripes and that one has the green so that worked out good and i cannot remember his sculpt i never can remember it i think it's lewis but i can't remember the sculptor's name and he was made by in love with reborns stephanie ortiz and he has the most beautiful soft hair i think he's the baby that has the softest hair that I have. I believe he was painted by Stephanie and 
rooted by Jackie. Ortiz, there we go. He's beautiful, and I always keep it in a mohawk. He's got beautiful hair, really. And he looks a little mad and grumpy, but I'm not sure. He's thinking about it. He's painted very nicely, so he's got his Santa sleeper on. Like I said, it's a special treat because usually he's wearing his regalia, his Native American regalia. And his name is Big Thunder, after my husband, who is also Native American. That's his kind of his nickname, his Indian name, when he was a boy. So there he is. He's got dark brown eyes. He took it off with Sirius there. So he's that pretty boy. And then I'm going to move over to the wall over here, or to the changing table, because I didn't have enough room to put all these babies. We're doing, I think, eight babies today. I have to get these babies shown for Christmas. I hope y'all are having a great Christmas time or holiday so far. I do appreciate y'all watching and I'm glad y'all it seem y'all seem to enjoy sharing in the babies. Look at what she's looking at. What do y'all think she's looking at? She's looking right up at the ceiling. She's very intently looking. Maybe she's waiting for Santa to come. I don't know. What you waiting for girl? Grumpy Grace. All right, we're going to move on. I'm going to move my light over some. It's right in the way. So we're looking at the changing table that's against my wall here. And here is one of the other reborns made after my son. This is my son as a newborn. And like I said, I painted him when I first started. So his painting doesn't look so great as the others. But he has his little hat on because his hair is a hot mess. Painted hair. But anyway, he still looks handsome. And he has alabaster skin. I did get that right because my son's skin is still alabaster. Very um, white and pretty, though. Handsome. So he is wearing a vintage outfit. And um, it's another velour uh, sleeper. It's red. And it's got, it looks like, let's see, is it a stocking? Yes, that's a red stocking on there with toys in it. It's got a bear. Looks like a wrapped present and another bear and some lights, Christmas lights, holly berries. And it says, my first Christmas. So there he's in that. I don't know why. He's coming up and looking very chunky, but he's not that chunky. And he's got his little bracelet on. This says his name, Sydney. So now we're moving on this old guy. I have to tell you the story about him. I did make him myself. He has a clay snout. And he was inspired by a design by Twisted Beanstalk Nursery or Bean Shanine. I want to give her credit because it's um, mainly her design. And I will never sell him because of that reason. I will always keep him. I'm not going to profit off of somebody else's design. And he's pretty handsome. He's made from the Fei Yen kit. And then I put um, a clay snout on him. You know, and, and drew the, uh, painted the accents and everything. And the thing that happened, this side right here on his snout, this curly part, I picked him up one day and it just popped off. And I wasn't, like, putting any pressure on it or anything. It just popped off. So today I had to repair him and glue it back. So he's really grumpy about that. He's like, Mommy, you knocked my snout off and I don't appreciate it. So actually, yeah, if you can see the whole snout here, this over his lip is clay in his nose but he is from the Fei Yen kid he's a big boy he wears three to six months and this sleeper that he's wearing is Dr. Seuss and I got a baby a couple but have a couple babies from Twisted Breen Sock and she sent this outfit um with one of the babies and so I love it so he wears that and he's got a really cute um hat on knitted hat for Christmas so he's happy to be on and he's happy he got repaired he's very green Grinch so there he is and the last baby I'm showing today I know this little girl's got fans this is little fawn and she was made by candy love sparkle or Aaron and she is a pink lao kit she is beautiful she is made to look like an antique or old baby like she's weathered and maybe made out of leather so there she is. She has human hair. I believe that's what Erin told me. And look at her. She's smiling. She's got 
beautiful green eyes. They don't come up as green, but they are. And she is wearing a plaid. This is a newer outfit that I got, I think, maybe this year or last year. She's wearing a plaid um, dress with plaid bloomers underneath. And the collar is like a velour collar with flowers embroidered on it. And this whole front is embroidered. She's wearing her bracelets that that Erin sent with her Indian bracelets, Native American bracelets. And I don't know if I mentioned this, but she is Native American. I don't know if I mentioned that. I guess that was kind of obvious. And she is wearing also a vintage dress there, but she's also wearing um, some of the vintage clothes that I like to pick up when I find them. She's wearing these little vintage knee socks, and they're white, and they go up to her knees. And she's wearing these vintage baby shoes. So I'm hoping Erin or Candy Love Sparkle likes this video because she, she did a beautiful job on her, and she loves vin I know Candy Love Sparkle loves vintage clothes like I do. She really appreciates them, so... I thought it was cute how she's in her vintage clothes with her shoes on today. She's got two pigtails, and they just like to have a mind of their own. They like to stick up and stick out all around. So she's got her little red bow in there for Christmas. So I just want to show you all the babies today. And I'm going to try to get off because I don't want these videos to be super long. Because I know it's kind of hard to watch long videos sometimes. Anyway, just want to show you these sweet babies for Christmas. And they want to say hi to their aunties. And I will talk to you soon, tomorrow. I'll make some more videos of the rest of the babies. Um, stay safe, stay blessed, and I appreciate each and every one of you. And I hope you have um, a wonderful holiday with your family and loved ones. Talk to you very soon.